Hey everyone, now we're gonna continue our discussion of sulfur and we're gonna go into the details of how sulfuric acid is made. Well, sulfuric ha acid has the formula H2SO4 and it's made by a process called the contact process. Okay, so now we're gonna walk through the details of this process and how sulfuric acid is made. So let's take a look at this diagram. Okay, so first sulfur solid is passed through here, which is a furnace, and also with some dry air. This mixture is heated and sulfur dioxide is produced with some oxygen using this reaction so sulfur solid reacts with air which contains oxygen gas to give us sulfur dioxide and sulfur more sulfur dioxide is passed through with oxygen onto a vessel that has a catalyst vanadium oxide so here there is vanadium oxide and we know that the catalyst is a substance that speeds up the reaction but does not get involved. So this mixture is heated to 450 degrees Celsius, you have to know that by heart. And here, as we said, the sulfur dioxide and the oxygen is passed through to the catalytic vessel and sulfur trioxide is created using this reaction sulfur dioxide gas plus oxygen gas to give sulfur trioxide gas and this reaction can go both ways but it's an exothermic reaction so it's favored by low temperatures Therefore, producing sulfur trioxide is relatively economic. So, sulfur trioxide is then passed through and sprayed with more sulfuric acid that's already been made. So here, there are showers of sulfuric acid sprayed onto the sulfur trioxide. And a substance that's called oleum is produced. And oleum has the formula H2S2O7 and it's in the liquid form. The oleum is then mixed with some water right here, passed through, and sulfuric acid is then yielded. Okay, and here are some waste gases. So I know this is a bit too much, but let's go over it again. So sulfur solid is passed through a furnace with some dry air and this yields sulfur dioxide gas. Sulfur dioxide gas is then passed on with some oxygen onto a catalytic vessel that has vanadium oxide under a temperature of 450 degrees Celsius. Then sulfur trioxide is then produced. Sulfur trioxide is then passed onto some showers of already made sulfuric acid. Then a substance called oleum is produced. The oleum is then mixed with some water and then sulfuric acid is created. Okay, you have to know this process off by heart because the examiner might ask you about the equations right here and is going to ask you about the temperature under which the process goes and also about the catalyst involved so these three these things you should know them off by heart and hopefully this diagram have made things more clearer for you guys Stay tuned, we're going to talk about more functions and uses of sulfuric acid, so good luck!